My name is Tabitha Sayre, and I will be reading my transcript for week 11 in Human Growth and Development. Uh, <clears throat> so growth and development throughout the lifespan is very different for every person. Um, the developmentalist Albert Bandura actually developed the social learning theory. That theory indicates that a person um, learns by observing the actions of others and imitating them. So um, in other words, it's observational learning. Um, the social learning theory could be applied when basing someone's actions on the nature versus nurture aspect of human growth and development. This would indicate that a person's actions become a part of them because they observed the behavior in others around them. <clears throat> There's a saying that indicates the influence of life events and observed behavior influence the way a person grows and makes choices. That saying is, as a twig is bent, so grows the tree. So that saying actually comes from Alexander Pope. He was an English poet in the early 18th century. Um, so that saying basically means that early influences can cause change in a permanent way. So for example, when you're growing a tree, you can influence the direction of growth by tying it down a certain direction or guiding it a different way as it grows longer and taller. So Jordan King, a man who murdered his grandparents after living a life of crime is an example of how this saying would apply to a person. Um, Jordan King is a 24 year old man in the emerging adulthood stage of his life. This stage of life typically represents a time that someone is exploring their identity. A person will also learn to be stable and they're very self-focused. Um, Jordan King's grandparents were found beaten to death in their home on February 22nd of 2024. Um, Jordan had been staying in their home since his release from prison on February 15th of 2024. Um, so the saying, as the twig is bent, so grows the trees, can be applied to Jordan's case due to being raised in an environment where Immor immoral actions were normal. This would indicate that Jordan observed behaviors that was unacceptable according to society. As he observed these behaviors, he became established to acting out the same behaviors. Um, Jordan also spent most of his adult life in jail due to bad choices, and it would only make sense that he continue that lifestyle outside of jail walls due to the social learning theory.